Want to take your videos to the next level? Today I'll show you how to create this stunning 3D screen effect in Filmora 14 just like you see it here. It's easy, fast and will make your video stand out. First, open a new project and drop the video you want to work on on your timeline. Drag your playhead to the beginning and go up to effects. Go to Boris effects and stylize. Then find the effect called BCC cast shadow and drag it down to your video. Then click on this star shape icon here and go to the right side. Click on image plane so you open up all the effect settings. Then click on all keyframes except opacity, down to master scale. The first toggle here is zoom in and zoom out. The second is for tilt the screen up and down. Third one is for left and right. This one is for circle rotation and master scale is actually the same as the first one for zoom in and zoom out. So we will leave those keyframes at the beginning like they are. Then we will drag the playhead just a little over the middle and we will put minus 50 to our second toggle to tilt it like this. In the fourth toggle insert 50 and drag zoom in like this. Then position the screen with holding and dragging X and Y axis. Now move your playhead to the end and at the zoom toggle window type let's say minus 1500 to zoom in. In the second toggle window type minus 85 and in the fourth type 90. Go up and we need to adjust X and Y axis. Drag Y axis to the right so we get the screen down and X axis to the left to get the screen more to the left side. We can also increase zoom in to let's say minus 2220. Now do not forget to click on remaining keyframes so we fix positions everywhere. If we play it now we have this animation. I'm sure you noticed that in the middle of the clip the transition at our second keyframe was not smooth. We can fix that with right click on the timeline, show keyframe animations. Here we see all keyframes that we did in the middle of our video with changing the positions, rotations and zoom. Now we need to change the graphs on all of them. So click on the first one, highlight the lower one and change the graph to continuous curve. Do the same for all the keyframes. So when we play it now, you will see that we got nice smooth 3D screen effect. Hope you liked the tutorial and if you did, I would appreciate if you hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss the next video. See you in the next one.